Hi everybody! So today I am back doing another Too Faced Semi-Sweet Chocolate Bar Palette tutorial. I got a couple of requests for this, um, one from Jocelyn at TCP2012. She wanted more semi-sweet tutorials, and Stephanie Albert wanted me to do a tutorial using Rum Raisin. So that's what I'm doing today, and Rum Raisin is just this kind of taupey brown shade. So, let's get into it! Alrighty, so starting off, I've already primed my eyes, and I have a zit right into my eyebrows, and of course, a zit right underneath my nose. So lovely, I know. Starting off with the color Moose, or Moes, which is my cat's name. Um, and this is going to be my transition color. It's a very orangey, warm tone brown. So this is going right in my crease, and um, I don't know, I always start off with my transition color. It's just a good way to start off, so I'm doing that. And then I'm taking the color called Truffled, which is not as orangey as mousse, but still on the warm side. So I'm layering that right on top of mousse. Sorry, I can't say mousse because I always think of saying moise. It's so weird, whatever. So layering those two shades on. Moving on to the shade Licorice, which is a really dark, dark black guys. This color is so pigmented. Um, this eye I did pretty well. I didn't um, apply too much all at once. I built up the color, thank goodness. But I'm putting this color in my crease and then in the outer corner and I'm shaping that out. It's, I wouldn't say it's a cut crease, but it's more defined than what I usually do. So in order to blend that black shade out, I'm taking Nougat. Nougat, right? Yeah, Nougat. And that's like a pinky beigey color. I'm also taking a mousse and just blending that out so that it's not super harsh, but I still kind of want that distinct line. So I'm just blending it out a little bit. And then um, here I'm just building up the color even more. Um, and I mean, you can go as dark or as light as you'd like. I kind of went in the middle. It's still pretty defined, but all good. And this eye, I went way too dark too fast. Um, I just, you know, I underestimated the color. That color is so pigmented. So I'm doing the same exact thing. I'm building up the color and then blending out with the same two shades, Nougat and Mousse. I'm using the NYX HD concealer to conceal my under eyes and then also to clean up any eyeshadow. To set all of that concealer, I'm using the Anastasia Contour Kit. I'm using that banana shade and just setting my under eyes and then I'm also going to be setting my chin and my forehead. I'm going back into Licorice and just touching up the crease and the outer V. Just to make sure everything is well blended, I'm picking up Nougat again and doing one last blend. To highlight my brow bone, I'm using coconut cream, and this color is also going to help with the transition process. It's going to help all the colors kind of blend into each other and um, just get rid of any harsh lines. And then I'm taking Rum Raisin, which originally I was just going to put in the middle portions of my lid, and then I figured, okay, well, what am I going to put on the inner portions? And then I said, you know what, let's just put Rum Raisin on the whole lid. So that's what I'm doing here. I'm doing my regular concealer routine and then I'm also going to be cleaning up the edges with some concealer. So now I'm taking Licorice and I'm concentrating this color mainly on the outer portion of my lower lash line and then whatever's left on my brush I'm just starting to drag it in towards the inner portion of my lower lash line. For mascara I'm using Maybelline's Colossal Nope. Nope, nope, nope. I'm using Maybelline's Color Sensational Mascara, which I do really like. I only used one mascara today. Boop, boop. And then I just figured I would show you the rest of my face. I'm taking uh, the Anastasia Contour Kit again and just taking that middle shade in the um, 
on the second row. I think it's called Fawn. And I'm just going to contour, bronze up. I'm not going to go super crazy with it. I'm doing my temples and my cheeks, and then I'll also drag it down my jawline. For blush, I decided to use Warm Soul. I haven't used this blush in such a long time. I forgot how pretty it is. It's like a kind of like a pinky a bronzy blush. It's beautiful. It's a, a, one of MAC's mineralized blushes. Super duper pretty. And then moving on to the lips, I decided to use my new MAC lip liner in Strip Down, which is just a nude liner. So I'm going to line my lips and then on top, I, okay, on top, at first I had um, Honey Love by MAC and it was just way too nude for me. So after I line my lips, I'm just going to be putting Sonia Kashuk's lipstick. I will leave the name down below on top, which I liked so much better. More of a pinky nude. And that completes this look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And for all of those who requested this video, I hope you guys enjoyed it as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. As usual, I really appreciate it. I will see you next time. Have a great day. Bye.